episode 2. And we're going to try to kill that boss, as well as maybe... Uh, what the hell's going on here? My mixer is tripping out. I'm not sure this is recording, but yeah, we're going to try to kill a boss. We're going to try to explore a little bit more. Okay, yeah, it's, it's recording, so sorry about that, guys. I had to check that and make sure we were good. Alright, so. Let me see the map a little bit. There was a section this way that I didn't check, so. Go ahead and do that. Oh, I can't get there. I think that's. smoother, eh? Ah. You just infinitely farm SP there, I suppose. I can't do anything there either, so... I'll get my HP back from save room again. <gasps> Probably doesn't want to respond the way I wanted to right now. Okay, so he just like went to the next. That was odd. So we gotta go to the right and then up. Of course. You know what? I'm gonna be cheap and just grab my HP again because that was stupid.
level up, but... Now the boss is somewhere over there to the right. We don't want to go there yet. I'm trying to get a little stronger first. Because we got wrecked last time we fought him. Could stop here. Let's stop here real quick. Get our health. <sighs> oh, let's try to shiver this our way. went in a giant circle. I think we have to go kill that boss. Here we do. Right, because that path is cut there. Hey, let's go do it. Like I'm 
we're supposed to be able to go. Yeah, okay, here we go. Oh, so you don't see you on you. I'm gonna skip this cinematic so because we've done it before. Come, grip me. We're leaving. Debo, wait. If you want to see it, make sure you check out episode one. Sorry about that, guys. I was getting a call. I had to decline. I know. village? What happened to it? The demons Jeeble summoned? They've moved faster than we hoped. Miriam, we have to hurry. This was where we were supposed to meet our contact. All right, but wait. Let me clear the area. There are still demons about. All right, so... We... Gonna go back and save it because we are weak. Okay, so now we're gonna see 
I should just try to go Promise you'll be careful. Can't shop or anything like that yet. Arvant villain. <laughs> That's pretty good damage, huh? Takes a lot of my spell power thing, though. Mana power. <laughs> Look at that, we just handled that for them. Thank you, Miriam. You know who I am. And that means... I'm sorry we couldn't get here sooner, Dominique. So this is our contact. Yes, the church sent me. As an exorcist. And we're lucky to have you, Dominique. And the church you, Miriam. Thank you for guiding her here, Johannes. You wouldn't have asked if it wasn't important. But you should tell us why you need her. Miriam isn't one to shy away from danger. But she deserves to be armed with all the facts. Yes, very well. I told you when I contacted you that the Shardbinder Jebel is responsible for summoning the castle. Yes, there's no mistake about that. He admitted as much. What? You spoke to him? Then let me get right to the point. I find it curious that the outpouring of demons facilitated by one Shardbinder just happens to coincide with the sudden awakening of the other Shardbinder after exactly ten years. You're right, it is strange. But the Church doesn't get to drag Miriam into this just because the timing is odd. Oh, do you decide for her then? I asked you to bring her here so she could see the horrors that have befallen the village and make an informed choice. I have no intention of forcing you, Miriam. You don't have to. I gave Jeebel my word that I would stop him. What happened here only strengthens my resolve. Thank you, Miriam. I am sorry to put it on your shoulders. Um, pardon me? Oh, hello there. Are you all right? We didn't mean to ignore you. I'm all right, thank you. You are quite welcome. Do you have a n- Anne! What a lovely name! Anne, you shouldn't be out here. Let me take you somewhere safe. Oh, all right. Come on, this way. That seems kind of weird. I did some looking around before, and this place seems secure. Yes, agreed. Johannes, you, Anne, and I will remain here. We can assist Miriam from safe ground. What? We can't ask her to brave the castle alone. Don't be foolish. She is trained in combat. Are you? We would only get in the way. Uh, I'll be fine, Johannes. Please. <sighs> but we'll be here if you need us. Let's not waste any time. Come back if you need anything. I'll get a workshop running so... Thank you, Joe. I know you're strong, but... Be careful. <laughs> I will. Yeah! <sighs> 
So what do you do? Welcome. Since this is your first time here, let me tell you a little bit about the supply post. Uh, please. I have made arrangements so you can buy and sell items here. I would have liked to provide what you need for free, but seeing as we are largely cut off from the church's funds out here, I will need money in order to keep the supply post stocked. I hope you don't mind paying. No, I understand. I appreciate you doing what you can. I can also buy shards from you, if you no longer need them. Wait, is trade in demon shards even allowed? Of course. The church would sooner gather them up and make certain they are purified. I am not permitted to sell them, but I can buy them. You may want to keep extras, since possessing multiple shards of the same type amplifies its power. But there is a... And more importantly, if you carry a large number of shards, your body's corruption may accelerate, but I'll find a way to deal with that myself. I still recommend selling your shards as a means of making money. All right, I know you're looking out for me. I think that explains everything. Now, would you like to have a look around? What are you looking to buy? Let's see, what do you sell? Do you sell any weapons? What are you looking to sell? Is this right? Then we have a deal. Is this right? Then we have a deal. Is this right? Many thanks. Is this right? Many thanks. Is this right? Thank you. What are you looking to sell? What are you looking to buy? Hmm. A lot of stuff. I want to eventually be able to get this, uh, Flameberg here. But that is a lot of money that I don't have. What are you looking to sell? Sell these, oh, but I forgot to give this to you. Not right Thank now. You. I and they all have. I'll do it. I know you will. So there Not are the still kid. demons outside. Okay. <gasps> Dominique, what is all this machinery? That is photographic equipment we've been for to put it more plainly. It allows me to capture images of real life. What? Really? Unfortunately, I don't have the silver bromide. I'll see if I can find it. Silver bromide, okay. Yeah! Yeah! Wow, so I could theoretically just farm the money necessary. Ah, uh, here she is. You have to marvel at the church's resources. Look at what they've provided for us. I know, it's incredible. So, what I can do for you here in the workshop, 
is take materials you bring me and transmute them into new items. But the alchemy is easier to show you than explain. Here, I have some materials we can use, so let's try transmuting them. What are we There's transmuting this time? Friends. Sound of that. Maybe we can make that, but I don't think we want to do anything with this app. But it's cool to see how much stuff we can make. Okay, we can cook food. Okay, we can enhance shards. I'll this go is, with this. Oh. Can do that right away. There, all done. Okay, right too. Increase the number of projectiles casted at once. Okay. Oh, I can dismantle stuff. Hmm. How interesting. Alright. So we have a pretty fundamental understanding of what's going to go on here. Debating this great axe, but I don't think so. Once I've yeah, transmuted just... an item, I'll pass it on to Dominique, so she can carry it at the supp- I'll do my best to inform you of what items you can make from what material, but when it comes to items I don't know about, you'll have to find a formula for me and- I understand. Also, the demon crystal you've obtained, the shards, those can be transmuted the same way as items. Each shard requires specific materials, but it's worth it to make your shards more useful. Try it when you get the chance. I think I will. Also, neither one of us has been eating well. No wonder. And so if you bring me the ingredients, I can use alchemy to prepare meal. With proper nutrition and a very diet, you have the potential to get much stronger. New food for the first time will provide Miriam with a stat boost. Okay. Assuming I can 
dropping on that, right? for a second. Wearable, resin, stones. Oh, I mean, it gives you pretty good stats, so we'll roll with it. Saving field, Toronto.
Good chest guard. Excellent. Not so excellent, actually. We'll go ahead and break that down. Holy crap. Alright guys, so I appreciate you rocking with your boy. That is kind of do it for now. I'm gonna... Well... Hmm. I don't know. Let's do a little bit more. I thought we were gonna end it there, but you know what? I'm feeling brave now. Let's see what's happening. Another boss. Miriam? It can't be. Alfred? Why are you here? Johannes. That fool of an apprentice should have stayed out of this. You have a lot to explain for. After all the terrible things you've done? All that is in the past. I'll not be defending my actions to you. Don't I deserve it? You were like a father to me. Well, enough, child. I am here for the book. Jebel has the book. What are you talking about? If you don't already know, then let us keep it that way. <laughs> Alfred. How are you still alive? Ugh, what were you thinking in coming here? You can answer my question first. 
All that matters is that I am alive. Did you come here for the book? Book? The Liber Logiath? Make no mistake. I won't let anyone touch... Not even you should touch it. Didn't what happened ten years ago teach you anything? I don't have time to argue with you. I just hope you are wise enough not to get in my... <sighs> you know full well my power exceeds yours. Take Miriam and leave this. Otherwise, you will... <laughs> I came here because something didn't feel right. But I didn't expect him. Johannes, what is the Liebe Logaeth? It's... It's a book the Alchemy Guild once possessed that allows the Guild used it to bring about the Calamity ten years ago. And the Shardbinder's crystal acted as a kind of catalyst. A book like that shouldn't even exist. I know. Alfred must be trying to restore the Alchemy Guild to power, but we cannot let him lay hands on the Liber Logiath. He said Chibo had it. You know, I think I might have seen it. It makes sense, considering the situation we're in. He must... So now I have to stop Alfred too. No, let's focus on Jebel. If we can get to him and the book before Alfred does, we'll keep... Good point. All right. Dominique might know what to do about Alfred in the meantime. I'll head back to the village and see what she has to say. Oh, I got a mask. That's kind of cool looking. Okay, we killed him. I feel like this is about to be a boss. Some Mako weed. I'm sorry, I'm just saying. Seven plume perma. Oh, 
off so I can't go. Hmm. Alright, let's stop for a minute. Let's look at our map. So, that'll do it for today. We know what to expect. Uh, the next episode should be pretty fun. Because I'm going to make sure I explore the rest of that other area behind us. So, look forward to it, guys. Make sure you show your support. As this is still a pretty new uh, adventure here with Bloodstain. So, let me know if you like it. Also, if you like more commentary during the thing, uh, during the you know the video let me know I can talk more I just kind of think these games are better played when you're listening to all the dialogue and all that stuff so you know maybe I've got the wrong approach let me know and I'll be happy to do it the way that uh, most people think it should be done all right so until next time don't break nothing <laughs>